Hello everyone and welcome. My name is Bobby and you're watching Mind Island Design. In this video, I'll be showing you how you can use the baseline grid in InDesign to format your text and I'll show you how you can use every single baseline or you can use every other baseline just to format the text exactly how you want. So without further ado, let's get into the video. Let me just start by enabling my baseline grid and you can do that with your view options and then you can select baseline grid or you can also use the shortcut control plus alt plus apostrophe. All right, so now that we have our baseline grids enabled, let's grab our type tool and then just draw out a text frame. I'll just do like roughly half the page for now. And then let's just right click and fill with placeholder text. Now let's just select our text frame, go into our settings here and you'll see the option right here where you can align to baseline grid. So now your text is aligned to your baseline grid. So now as you see, our text jumps every other line. So what happens if we want our text to be on every single line? You may have tried to select your text and then just like decrease the size, which does work, but like what happens if you want your text to be actually 12 points? Quick fix for that is to change your letting, which is right next to your font size. So let's just decrease that. And uh, if I go down a couple times, you'll see like no, nothing changes. So you may have just like given up, but just keep decreasing your size and you'll see that the text jumps over to the next line. Now the text is pretty tight. You probably don't want it to be this close because it's very hard to read. It's just a big block of text. So what happens if we want our text to be 12 points, but we want our text to be on every single baseline. You can adjust this by, let's just change our letting to auto so we can see what it is default. So 14.4 points. Let's go up to edit, preferences, and grids. And now let's change our um, baseline grid increment every 12 points. Let's make this the 14.4 that is in our letting, okay? And let's hit okay. And now just like that, the text automatically jumps to every single line and it looks you know, perfect. It's exactly what InDesign thinks looks good automatically. So let's just go with that. You can also, if you want your text to be on every other line, you can just increase your letting. So here's yeah every other line, or we can do like double line. So just keep going up in your letting and eventually it will jump down. There we go. And then we can drag our text frame down. And that's how you can easily use the baseline grid to format text in InDesign. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, it would mean a lot if you left a thumbs up and subscribed if you haven't already. It helps a lot to support the channel and to continue making content like this. If you want to continue formatting text in InDesign, I highly recommend checking out my splitting and spanning text video where I show you how to make columns and rows with just one text frame. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.